You know, we trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts, maybe more than we should, but this guy fits the bill. Maybe doesn't stand out in any one area on film, but plus skills everywhere. And you gotta think tonight, Joe, with his skill set, he's more than comfortable really anywhere this fight goes. If he needs to stand and strike, he can do it. If the fight hits the canvas, he can submit you. A lot of different skills brought to the table by this young man. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He does not mind standing or going to the ground, and this diversity makes him very unpredictable. So here he is, the biggest superstar in mixed martial arts history, the former two-division UFC champion, Conor McGregor, back in a mixed martial arts setting for the first time in a long time. Of course, many of you ingested his boxing match with Floyd Mayweather. Thankfully, all of that is in the past, and Conor McGregor's present is a return to the greatest proven ground in MMA here tonight. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So more than 15 years, the gap in age between these two fighters, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. Now here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting! This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Body out of Huntington Beach, California, USA, Dan Man. And now it's the his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting. Dublin Island, the notorious Connor McGregor! All right, get the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Uh, you ready? You ready? Let's go. Well, play. how good is this? Reminds me of the good old days of Pride, the UFC Grand Prix single night tournament. This has been highly anticipated by fight fans around the world. Oh, and 
there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by McGregor. Big left hand lands upstairs. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Trying to establish that jab once again. Again engaging in the clinch here, Joe. Tags him. Trying to pass here. Hammerfist gets through. Big punch from the bottom. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse by the minute. Looking ghastly at this point. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Connor. He lands a hammer fist. He's getting the ground and pound going pretty good here. Nicely executed sweep, winds up in guard. Good left hand by Connor. Midway through round one. He's inside control here. Oh, elbow to the head. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Postures up here. He's got a half guard here. Just over two minutes to go. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. He's now working from side control again. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Oh, he found the target there, that'll work. Oh, mount! Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, elbow to the head there by McGregor. He's now back in north-south again. He's back to side control. And he's controlling him here. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Good punch. Back to the mount again. Oh, going for the arm bar now. That might be tight. He's in full mount here, and he's looking for the arm bar. What he wants to do is, first thing he wants to do is secure the arm, tie it up. Then he wants to scoot his hips forward, rotate the hips, throw his leg out. Won the fight by arm bar. Beautiful job. Yeah, really impressive work out of him here tonight. He had to work for it, no doubt about it, but a nice job to isolate and ultimately secure the arm and then get the tap from the arm bar. So a pretty submission finish turned in by that fighter here tonight. And here's the end of the fight. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 10 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, the Notorious Hammer McGregor! So, and still your UFC lightweight champion, the notorious Conor McGregor, finding a way yet again, seemingly with the odds stacked against him, to get his hand raised. He has had doubters every step of the way, and he has muted nearly all of them at this point in time. Big stage, bright lights, and yet again, the brightest star, the notorious Conor McGregor, Congratulations on a big win here tonight.